Alright guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. It's been a little bit, but we've been a little bit busier. Today, we're working on my transmission. I had a code of a solenoid for one of my sensors or whatever for the transmission. And so we're replacing that right now. Currently, I'm on the way to the bank. I'm gonna go get some more cash so I can get some more parts. So right now we're on our way to AutoZone. I'll be getting a transmission filter. I already got all the fluid and my sensor and everything, so we should be good. All right, so check it out. This is the old filter. It's the new one I got. Then, dude, these guys, I came in looking for, oh shit, right. All right guys, so this is what we're looking at. So I, I, I switched this one out. The cylinder. Solenoid. So let me explain this a little bit, uh, I'm a little dirty. So in order to take this pan out, you gotta move this cross member. Now this one's holding up the yoke and for the drive shaft that's connecting to the transmission or whatever. So what we did was unbolted these on both sides. There's one in the middle here. You get this jack, jack it up just a little bit enough to get this out of the way. Then we were able to get this out. All right, guys, so I'm gonna insert this video into the one where I was doing the transmission stuff. We got a code on the check engine light that we have, uh, it says faulty, faulty electric connection or something like that. So the guy at AutoZone said it was that sensor. And so I switched it out and the check engine light hasn't come off. So that's kind of the issue right now, but that's all right. We're gonna get it fixed eventually. Just sucks because I can't smog it, <laughs> but but yeah, right now I'm just gonna do a quick little oil change on it and then we'll end the video.
end today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.